virtual machine. So there we go. The Hyper V virtual machine on Windows 10, and I'm installing Fedora version 35. So as soon as you boot it from the ISO image, which was downloaded from the Fedora website, and the live image, I will install. The, click on Install to Hard Drive. Let me expand this. Okay. <clears throat> so over here, this is the first screen you get. Uh, definitely, I will choose English and English United States as my default keyboard. Continue. Now, I will give you the summary page where it tells you you have this keyboard selected. Your time so right now i'm in toronto so let's do this the time zone and now destination i have virtual hard disk uh, 20 G gb nothing in it so i'm just gonna click this and press done uh, no this selected why is that Okay, do this done one more time. All right, so I don't know what happened the first time, but second time it worked. Begin installation. All right, so the installation has been done. Now I'm gonna click finish installation. And I'm not sure it's gonna restart by itself or do I have to restart it? Just gonna wait. I think it's. Yeah, I think we need to restart. Restarting the virtual machine here. All right, so I have to restart manually, which I did, and I eject the CD and start it from the hard disk. So let's continue with the installation here. The first thing you need to choose is your location service and automatic problem reporting. I will disable it by default.
the third party repository is disabled so i will keep it like this now we need to put the account information here Set a password. Okay, let's take a tour of this system. So it's telling me to press the super key, which is the Windows key. So that's what the super key do.